Good day, friends. It is me, HL Mod Tech, and I am back with another designer showcase. So let's get cracking. Friends, we are on hlmodtech.com because this messaging tool was how the user first reached out to me. Now, though, friends, they're using the epic Tinkercad community discard. If you haven't joined, friends, the link is right there. All right, friends, so let's paste in a share link and let's see what Unlimited Model Works created. Oh my gosh, this is incredible. Friends, this is the Reaper SB by Unlimited Model Works. Oh my gosh, this is incredible. Extra bonus, he added notes so that we can check it all out. Let's work through the features of this amazing aircraft. Let's start back here with the details. This is the Altaria Core Engineering Model Reaper High Speed Stealth Bomber, cost 800 million bucks. Here we have the engineering logo, and this is the Federation logo. This ship is 61 meters long, wingspan of 56 meters, and a height of 15 meters. This is the Federation logo, which indicates affiliation. While it's not shown, the specific Reaper was given the name, the Plague Doctor. Over here, we've got a cooling intake. This is a remote gunner. These are secondary systems, so now we are talking about inside the ship. Friends, I removed the transparent steel windshield and check out the inside of this craft. Oh my gosh. Dashboard, aiming circle, ship hologram, steering control, hollow screens, pilot seat and controls, pitch roll control, thrust control. This is the main navigational computer. These details are insane. Unlimited Model Works, this is one of the coolest layouts I've seen yet. If we spin around and look back in here, we've also got the secondary systems. And on this side, we've got the secondary nav computer. Oh my gosh. If we spin around and take a look at the front, this is the high explosive missile. This is the Talon Pravda MK 740mm Gatlin gun. And over here, we've got suspended weapons placement. Wow. Over on this side, we've got winglets. This is the secondary hyperthruster. Max atmospheric speed of 4,600 kilometers per hour. Here we have a 50 cal remote quad plasma turret. This is the primary cruise thruster. And these are the thrust vectors. Back here, we can see the thrust. This is a wing opening for cooling. All right, friends, this is so amazing. You can see that I have got transparency turned on and we have got internal information. Here we've got the engine display. This is the reactor core. The reactor refueling happens every five years. This is the warp drive unit. And right here we've got an armored vital box. This is the shower, the sink, and the toilet. For the restroom area, there is also a secondary, there is also a bombardier seat with controls. So I removed the skin temporarily so we can check that out. Heads up displays, all that amazing information at your fingertips. What an amazing weapon. Here we have Talon Argus MK-15 guided tactical explosives and there is a rotary bomb rack. That's how they deploy. Here we have a second remote gunner, and this is a personal storage unit. Right here we have crew beds and more foldable seating for troops. Down here you can see the bomb bay doors that open and close. And over here we can check out the armaments. The choices we have are high explosive missile, electromagnetic pulse missile, Swarm missile, guided gas bomb, guided high explosive bombs, guided incendiary bombs, high explosive torpedoes, homing torpedoes, and finally, the proton torpedo. Unlimited Model Works, this is absolutely amazing. So impressed with the efforts and the details on this amazing creation. Friends, remember, if you ever make something awesome or terrifying and want to share it with me, it is so simple. You can click this button, generate a link, copy the link, and then you can reach out and share it with me. I am HL Mod Tech on Facebook, Instagram, and Gmail. You can also track me down on Twitter. I am HL Tinkercad.
If those options are not available, don't forget you can also visit my website, hlmodtech.com. I've got a page dedicated to Tinkercad with tons of amazing lessons. And then down at the bottom, there is the epic built-in messaging tool. You can click that button, add your information, hit send, and reach me almost instantly. Added bonus though, friends, there is also a Tinkercad Community Discord. Friends, if you click this link, you can join the Tinkercad Community Discord. It is a great place to discuss all things Tinkercad. Finally, friends, don't forget you can also click the Designer Showcase and check out all these amazing users' profiles. When you click on somebody's profile, make sure you find a design you think is amazing like this awesome train. Give them a reaction and show them you're impressed with the work they put in to their awesome creations. I also want to remind you about the Tinkercad Design Nuclear Reactor. You can submit a link for us to check out. It is a fantastic way to get your design some extra publicity. Once you submit your design, make sure you click on the Nuclear Reactor and check out all the amazing things made by other users. When you click on these and click on the link, you can instantly check out their amazing design. And if you're impressed, you can click up here on the Reaction button and give them feedback on their amazing designs. Friends, we are all here today, though, because of this awesome design by Unlimited Model Works. Dude, thank you so much for taking time to create this and share it with us. It is absolutely awesome. Friends, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a like. Please also hit that share button so more people can learn about HL Mod Tech. Of course, if you got a question, comment, or suggestion, add it down below. And if you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button. And last but not least, hit that notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.